This is an unpackaging of the templates that I've created for you guys. This is the nine box template. That's a freebie um, that I'm giving away at um, our Facebook page. So I want to go through the template with you guys so you can see how you can use it. Um, in Photoshop is this uh, what you're seeing right now. And what you're seeing really is just a directions layer that I placed on top. The directions layer um, gives you a little bit of instructions on how to use the, um, the template. And if you look to the right over here, you'll see that there's a layer that says directions. Click it back on if you need to, or you can even just take it and throw it out. So, oh, well, don't make a copy of it unless you really like it. Just take it and put it in the trash. You probably will not need to use it again. And now what you're going to be left with here are some layers on the right hand side. So what you can see here is the top layer. It says T. That's a um, text layer. I just put it there because I thought maybe you'd want to, I want to show you that I left a lip at the top that you can then add in um, text or designs. Um, I just threw in happy holidays from our family to yours, but you can really do whatever you like up there. I just want to illustrate how it could be used. Um, you can again turn that layer off, turn it back on. Whatever you want to use, delete it, change it, however you like to use it. Um, the next layer down is the grid lines layer. And I want to show you, I'm going to turn off all the other layers in this Photoshop. And you'll see that really all that is, is my grid lines, okay? Everything that you import into, all the pictures that you import into this Photoshop template is going to go under the grid lines layers because it's just your white layer and you have um, an opening. You have the opening for so the bottom layer, that, that bright blue layer, that's really just a holding layer. That's just to illustrate where the pictures will go. Um, you don't really need that layer. And what I created here in between is a little color coded system that you can choose to use or choose not to use. It's really entirely up to you. Um, you may want to take your pictures, especially if you're working in a Photoshop template that has 9, 12, 15 photos. Once you've imported them into this template, and you start to organize them, you may want to at one point or another shut off um, a whole row of, lay of pictures at one time. So you can choose to take the pictures that you import and put them into these folders for you so that way you'll be able to shut them off and turn them back on as needed. Um, it's really just there for your convenience. Um, you can choose to use them, you can choose to delete them. In reality, what you really need is the grid lines without the so everything that you then import into this particular Photoshop file you will need to make sure that it, it is under your grid lines that is the most important piece um, the next video I'm going to show you how I take the pictures that I've already imported into Photoshop and how I'm going to bring them into this uh, Photoshop Photoshop uh, template Thanks for watching.